Hey guys, today I'll be doing one of the most classic videos of all time on YouTube of what's in my bag. But this is not just what's in my bag, but how I organize everything. So let's get right into it. For most bags I'm using, I like to keep everything organized in zip up pouches. The biggest advantage of organizing this way though, would be that it makes transferring everything from one bag to another a whole lot quicker and easier. Investing in a few nice pouches is also a good idea because you could use them as like a little clutch for running errands or going out for dinner, kind of like how I use this cat one. Now we can get started on what's actually in my bag. I'm going to take this hound's tooth pouch for example since I'm using it at the moment. I have some Dettol hand sanitizer, very important. And yes, that's a spare hair tie wrapped around the lid which I find is the most convenient place to keep it. You might recognize this pen from my LA vlog this year. I like the design of it so much that I always keep it with me. This might be the most important item that I always carry without fail, my portable phone charger. Mine is by the brand Anchor and it has like two or three full phone chargers in it or something. It's so good. This is a new addition to my bag this year. It's a mini lint roller. This thing is so useful for wearing black and it's also good because I'm a cat owner. Here I have some Orbit gum and you can never be too minty fresh. I also have some Eclipse mints. Of course, I have my Chanel Rouge Coco Shine in the shade Boy. Someone with long nails like me has always got to have a glass nail file on hand. And somebody who has a tendency to get really hangry like me has always got to have a snack on hand. At the moment, I've got a Cliff Bar in my favorite variety, chocolate brownie. Last but not least, we have my little bag hook, which is a crystal pink heart. It's just, it's, it's so me. And that is everything I keep in my main pouch and it's what I always have in my bag pretty much no matter what the situation. You can fit a lot into these things. We have some Skittle Sours of course. I always chuck a box of these in my bag if I'm going to the movies. I have my Laura Mercier foundation powder if it's the kind of day where I might need touch ups. Tissues might seem like something to always have on hand, but I actually rarely use them. Because I like to drink green tea as often as possible, I also have a tea bag with me. I have a mini bottle of water. Sometimes I also keep these All May makeup remover sticks with me. Here is my wallet. I'll link my blog post below where I go over it in more detail. I love large wallets that open up like this, so it's just perfect for me. Let's take a look at another pouch that I only keep with me in a large bag or when the day requires it. I've chosen this super basic pouch because it's really thin and lightweight but still packs a ton inside. So let's see what we have here. I have a multi-purpose soft cotton handkerchief because I am the freaking princess and the pea. Here I have a rose hand cream. What's this thing? Is it um, spare socks or a pair of stockings? Nope, we've got a whole long sleeve top in here. That's right, I sometimes keep an entire extra layer with me in case it gets chilly. This is a folding hairbrush. And yes, you get these from hotels in Japan. I have a spare lip color, a Revlon balm stain in the shade Honey. Last but not least, a pair of little stocking socks. And that's everything for that pouch. Now watch the magic of how I fit it all back inside. So now I'll show you guys how I like to pack my bags. Since I most commonly tend to use a medium sized bag, I have my Topshop backpack here for example. I've got my main zip up pouch with all the goods inside, my water bottle. This bag even fits my umbrella. In goes my wallet of course, got some extra space so let's chuck in some Skittles and even a pack of tissues cause why the heck not. The pockets on this bag are super handy too, so I can store my phone if I need to. And now it's done. I find I can fit so much into this bag so compactly, it's, it's awesome. While I love my pouches, for a bag as small as this one by Rebecca Minkoff with its own built-in organization, I like to ditch the pouch. My wallet is too big for this bag, so I just use a spare pouch with my cards and cash inside. 
For all the rest, I've placed things both inside the pockets and loose at the bottom of the bag, but it's not like you need to look far to find whatever you're after. So that about sums it up. I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to hit the like button if you did. As always, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.